Zeal Education Society Redefining Excellence Welcome back. In the previous lecture, we have seen the concept of difference equation and solution of difference equation using the transform. And we have solved a couple of examples. Today, we will solve a few more examples with uh, some uh, diversity to strengthen the concept of solving difference equation using Z transform. So, let us consider an example. Determine the solution of difference equation x of k plus 2 plus 2x of k plus 1 plus x of k equal to 0 and the initial conditions are given as x of 0 equal to 0 and x of 1 equal to 1. So, let us start. Solution. We have x of k plus 2 plus 2x two of k plus 1 plus x of k equal to 0. So, first step taking z transform on both sides we get this will be z square x of z minus z square x of 0 minus z x of 1 plus 2 uh, in the bracket z x of z minus z x of 0 plus x of z equal to 0. So, this is the difference the z transform on both sides. Now, collecting the term I get z square plus 2z plus 1 x of z so these terms are remaining minus z square x of 0 x of 0 is 0 so this will go minus z x of 1 so here x of 1 is 1 so minus z and even this will go because x of 0 is 0 and this is equal to 0 so what i get x of z will be equal to this z and divided by this z square plus 2z plus 1. So, that is equal to z upon z plus 1 whole square. And in this case, what I prefer, no need to go for x of uh, z by z, because directly it is in a standard form. What we have? We have, uh, so for example, we have k a raised to k taken z transform is a z upon z minus a whole square. So, now take here a equal to minus 1. So, now I will rearrange this as so x of z is equal to what I will do uh, minus and minus z upon z plus 1 whole square. Can I rearrange this? Yes. So, what is a here? a is minus 1 and hence the solution will be taking inverse z we get this will be minus sign and uh, k into minus 1 raised to k. This is the solution. Very simple. But what was different in this? The different was repeated rules. Let us solve one more example. Now, what I will do? Here, the initial conditions are given. So I will not give the initial conditions, and still we shall be able to determine the solution of difference equation. How? Let us see. Determine solution of difference equation. x of k plus 2 minus 3 x of k plus 1 plus 2 x of k equal to u of k. 
वॉट इज गिवन यू ऑफ के इज गिवन विथ यू ऑफ के इक्वल टू वन फॉर के ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू जीरो इक्वल टू जीरो इफ के लेस देन जीरो एंड एक्स ऑफ के इक्वल टू जीरो इफ के इज लेस देन जीरो दैट मीन्स एक्स ऑफ के इज कॉजल दैट इज मैंशन बट द इनिशियल कंडीशन आर नॉट गिवन सो इन दिस केस हाउ टू सॉल्व फर्दर लेट एस स्टार्ट वी हैव एक्स ऑफ के प्लस टू माइनस थ्री एक्स ऑफ के प्लस वन प्लस टू एक्स ऑफ के इज इक्वल टू यू ऑफ के एंड नाउ इफ आई टेक जेड ट्रांसफॉर्म दिस विल बी जेड स्क्वेयर एक्स ऑफ जेड माइनस जेड स्क्वेयर एक्स ऑफ जीरो माइनस जेड एक्स ऑफ वन सो दिस रिक्वायर्स एक्स ऑफ जीरो एक्स ऑफ वन एंड नॉट गिवन देन इफ नॉट गिवन वी कैन जनरेट इट यूजिंग इनपुट सिग्नल सो वट आई विल डू नाउ put k equal to minus 2 so this will be x of 0 minus 3 x of k minus so minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 x of minus 1 plus 2 x of minus 2 equal to u of minus 2 now what is given here x of k 0 for k less than 0 so this is 0 this is 0 and u will also 0 uh, for k less than 0 that means so x of 0 is equal to 0 so x of 0 is obtained now we have to obtain uh, x of 1 so put k equal to minus 1 so now if i put k equal to minus 1 here this becomes x of 1 minus 3 times x of 0 plus 2 times x of minus 1 equal to u of minus 1 now this becomes 0 x of 0 is 0 so this also becomes 0 u of minus 1 is also 0 so here we get x of 1 also 0 so we get it though they are 0 but we obtained it and now we have the initial conditions now we we'll proceed with the, our general step taking Z transform on both sides of difference equation. Now what we get? This will be Z square x of Z minus Z square x of zero minus Z x of one minus three into bracket Z x of Z minus Z. x of 0 plus 2 x of z equal to z upon z minus 1 z transform this and this gives me what i will do i will collect the terms so this is z square minus 3z plus 2 into x of z all these terms are zero because the initial conditions are zero and this is equal to z upon z minus 1 and hence x of z is equal to what uh, z upon z minus 1 into z square minus 3z plus 2 let us do it further so what is I, what i get so x of z By z, this z will go one upon the roots of these are z minus one, z minus two. So this will be z minus one square into z minus two, and this can be written as a upon z minus one square plus b upon z minus one plus c upon z minus two. Now what is a? A is equal to one upon z minus two, keeping z equal to minus z equal to one. Sorry. So if I put here one, this will be one minus two is minus one. So A is minus one. Next is B. B for this case it will be d by d z of one upon z minus two with z equal to one, and that is equal to 
this is minus 1 upon z minus 2 square with z equal to 1 again this 1 minus 2 is minus 1 square is 1 1 by 1 is 1 so this is also minus 1 and then c c will be uh, 1 upon z minus 1 whole square with z equal to 2 and that is equal to 2 minus 1 is 1 so it's 1 and this gives me x of z by z as minus 1 upon z minus 1 square minus 1 upon z minus 1 plus 1 upon z minus 2 so x of z is minus z upon z minus 1 square minus z upon z minus 1 plus z upon z minus 2 and then the rest of the things are very simple so this is z upon z minus 1 square so inverse z of this is k so this will be minus k inverse z of z upon z minus 1 is 1 so this is minus 1 plus 2 raised to k so this is the solution of the difference equation now let us take one more example of the similar kind but uh, with some diversity determine the solution of difference equation x of k plus 2 plus 3 x of k plus 1 plus 2 x of k equal to u of k minus u of k minus 1 and with u of k equal to 1 for k greater than equal to 0 equal to 0 for k less than 0 and x of k equal to 0 for k less than 0 that means x of k is positive Again, here the initial conditions are not given. So, let us start solving this. We have x of k plus 2 plus 3 x of k plus 1 plus 2 x of k equal to u of k minus u of k minus 1. Again, initial conditions are not there. Highest coefficient is k plus 2. So, we will let us put k equal to minus 2. So, x of 0 plus 3 x of minus 1 plus 2 x of minus 2 equal to u of minus 2 minus u of this will be minus 3. Correct. Minus 3. Okay. And hence, x of 0 is, this is 0, all are 0, so this is 0. Then put k equal to minus 1. And then we get this as x of 1 plus 3 x of 0 plus 2 x of minus 1 equal to u of minus 1 minus u of minus 2. And then what I get here is again x of 1 is also 0 because this is 0, this is 0, all are 0. And now let us take z transform on both sides. Difference equation. What is difference in this different in this example? This is u of k minus 1. So this is advanced version, this is delayed version. So it is also possible. So this will be z square x of z 
माइनस जेड स्क्वेर एक्स ऑफ जीरो माइनस जेड एक्स ऑफ वन इन फैक्ट इज नाउ दिस इज नॉट रिक्वायर्ड टू बी रिटर्न बिकॉज दिस वैल्यूज आर जीरो वी नो बट स्टिल वी विल फॉलो द स्टैंडर्ड प्रोसेस जेड एक्स ऑफ जेड माइनस जेड एक्स ऑफ जीरो प्लस टू एक्स ऑफ जेड इक्वल टू जेड ट्रांसफॉर्म यू ऑफ के इज जेड अपॉन जेड माइनस वन माइनस दिस इज यू ऑफ के माइनस वन सो दिस इज टाइम शिफ्ट प्रॉपर्टी सो हियर वॉट वी नीड टू गेट जेड रेस टू माइनस वन इंटू जेड अपॉन जेड माइनस वन सो जेड रेस टू माइनस वन इंटू जेड गेट्स कैंसल एंड दिस रेमेन्स जेड अपॉन जेड माइनस वन and now what i get so this will be z square this is 0 this is 0 so z square plus 3z plus 2 into x of z is equal to this will be z minus 1 upon z minus 1 so this is 1 and so x of z is equal to 1 upon z square plus 3z plus 2 The remaining part is very simple, but still we'll complete the problem. Purpose of taking this example is solved now. To introduce this concept, but let us complete the numerical example. So x of z by z is equal to one upon z into z plus one into z plus two, because roots of this are z plus one and z plus two. Which is equal to a by z plus b by z plus one plus c by z plus two. Let us find the fractions very quickly. A will be equal to one upon z plus one into z plus two, keeping z equal to zero. So if I put here zero, this is one. This is two. So it's one by two. B is equal to one upon z into z plus two, keeping z equal to minus one. So if I put here minus one, uh, this will be plus one. This will be minus one. So this is overall is minus one. Next is C is equal to one upon z into z plus one, keeping z equal to minus two. So here, if I put here minus two, this will be minus one. This will be minus two. So this is one by two. And hence, x of z by z is equal to one by two z minus one upon z plus one plus one upon two into z plus two, which gives me x of z equal to one by two minus z upon z plus one plus one by two. Z upon Z plus two, and that gives me x of k by taking inverse Z transform. So one by two, Z inverse of one is delta k minus minus one raised to k plus one by two minus two raised to k. Done. So in this particular cluster of uh, seven to eight classes. We have studied the tool for the analysis of uh, discrete time control system. That is jet transform. Then inverse jet transform. Then the application of this jet transform, inverse jet transform, to solve the system equation. Why I call this as difference equation as system equation? Because this linear difference equation is used to represent the discrete time system. From the next class onwards. in again a cluster of 3 to 4 lectures we will see the concept of pulse transfer function of the system and we will apply the concept of this z transform for solving the pulse transfer function and for getting the system response for different class of inputs let us meet again in the next class thank you